So, how cold does it get? When we fly at 30,000 feet, it gets very cold outside. Inside the cockpit, it can go down to minus 60 Fahrenheit. But when we fly lower, with the sun coming into the cockpit, the temperature will rise to plus 100 degrees there. Plus 100 degrees Fahrenheit? Yes. So you're going from minus 60 yes. to plus 100? Yes. Now that's a challenge. That's a challenge for food, challenge for the pilot as well, challenge for the clothing. How long would it take you to teach someone who knows how to fly a regular airplane to fly this? I think it depends on the experience of the, uh, of the pilot. If the pilot has a vast experience between airplanes, sailplane, maybe helicopters, uh, I think it's not such a, such a long time. He has to go through in the flight simulator, understand uh, the behavior of the airplane. When we did our first flight in the flight simulator, and we, uh, we when I say we, is us, the test pilot, even the test pilot from uh, NASA, which is uh, also counseling us, uh, no one was able to land this airplane the first time. Now, hang on, hang on. The test pilot from NASA was not able to land the plane? He was not able to land the plane either. So he was also extremely disappointed, if I can put it, put it this way, until he understood, like we had to do, what had to be done and the way, in fact, this airplane has to be flown in order to land it. And then, of course, he, he was able to do it. When the test pilot from NASA wasn't able to do it, he probably didn't feel very good after that. We have to ask him. <laughs>